Hello everybody, I'm Claw72 and today I'm showing you guys a battle in my hell thing. We are on Himmelsdorf and I'm bottom tier and I'll be pushing to the white to get off my heavies. We only have one light tank so I decided it wouldn't be the best choice to head along over to the left to the tracks. I'll be pushing very aggressively here taking a precision follow up so I can spot the enemy vehicles. And I'm being careful to stay hold down, because the hell thing's taught is very sturdy. You guys will see that later in this battle. I'm hoping to maybe get a shot in on like the scorpion or something, but I do manage to put 200 damage in the tiger too, which is nice. The hell thing's gun is rather accurate, and I'm being very careful to stay behind cover here. And the tiger too, he clearly is a pretty skilled player as he's moving back and forth, I have a very hard time aiming in on his tort. But I just have to be patient, he is going to stop eventually. And I do manage to get another 200 damage in while he bounces on me. I come back out, staying, staying hold down, still he can only see my tort. And I aim in, and I can put another 400 damage into him, and he doesn't even have the chance to shoot me. I'm gonna come out, I managed to put another 200 damage in him, he bounces on me again, and he gives up now, he <laughs> he pulls back, he's done with this. I'm still full HP, and I notice that we're being flanked by the enemy, so I'm gonna turn around and go try to support my team back here. I come up on the lightweight from behind, I can finish him off. For my first kill. I'm trying to stay hold down here again as you guys can see. I get both my shots in. The AMX bounces. Like I said in the hell scene if you stay hold down you really will be bouncing a lot of damage. I load APCR and finish him off. For my second kill. I'm going to go push forward to the T23E3 now. And after I after I peek out, I shoot and I finish him off as well. Now it's four. Now it's four versus four. I'm gonna decide. I, I'm pretty sure the enemy heavies are gonna be pushing on us, so I'm gonna try and go around here to get a flank mm, to come come up on their flank. And the tiger too, whom I bothered so much earlier, comes out and I can finish him off too for kill number four. I make a mistake here, I drive forwards and the Luva can get me, which bothers me. I put two shots in on him. The I, I go too far forwards, the Annihilator can shoot me. Luckily I bounce two, two of his shots. I shoot the Luva and he stays with one hit point left. I have to retreat now. He does bounce on my front. But the AMX comes pushing me out here, luckily the Luva is killed beforehand. I am pretty low on HP now, so I have to watch out. The Annihilator is exposing himself though, and I can put a nice shot into him. Putting me over 3000 damage. Our AMX is playing rather poorly, he exposes himself. I do get a shot in the Scorpion though. And now our Amiel 1 is just going to finish the enemies off. Which leaves me with 3600 damage. I blocked over 1,600 damage. I got 4 kills. This battle does reward me with the ace. Very fun. To it totally shows how the Helsing can really stand up to the heaviest tanks of tier 8 when it's held down. Against that Tiger 2, he did not damage me at all. And I got over half his hit points away before he gave up. The Helsing is a very strong tank. And I'm happy to be owning it. Thank you guys for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy it, please consider subscribing or hitting that like button. Thank you, Claw72, out.